Hey guys, Brett here, and a couple of people have been asking me about email systems and about if I was going to promote a different email system uh, that has recently come out. Um, and because of that, I decided maybe I would give people an update on my new MyMail at Cloud-based software. Uh, MyMail is a software that I'm particularly proud of uh, because I put a lot of work and a lot of effort in this. We've been testing it for several months and we're going to be releasing it in April. But what I want to do in this video is show you some of the features that are inside of MyMail. Now, before I show you the features, I do want to point out something that's very important. If you actually look here, you can see this is the last message that I've sent. And if I go to emails, you can see all of my marketing emails are sent with my mail. -in. And the reason this is important is because no one should ever be selling anything to somebody else that they're not willing to use in their own business. My entire business is in the hands of this software. And that's why I feel confident selling it to other people because I'm selling them something that I've built that's good enough for my seven-figure business that I trust my seven-figure business into. So I feel that it's good enough to sell to other people as well. When you see people selling an email system and you're saying, this is the next greatest thing in the world, don't use AWeber, don't use GetResponse, use this system. And then they're sending from AWeber or GetResponse. It just screams stupidity. Now, my mail it itself is full featured. So right here, you can see me sending broadcast emails. So these are emails that you create. You can either send them out right away or you can schedule them to go out at a specific time and then you can broadcast them to your list. My mail it also allows you to send in full sequences. So you can actually create follow up sequences. So when people sign up via one of your sign up forms, you can send them an automated follow up sequence. And you can actually see, I even use my mail it for my follow up sequences. This is one that I've recently created that I've been testing out with some Facebook ads. And you can see, here's my entire sequence that I'm sending people to. I'm not only testing it out, but I'm also using it in my own business. Once again, Anything that I would sell to somebody else is only going to be something that I'm willing to use in my business myself. Now, if you're going to get people into your follow-up sequence or even onto your email list, obviously you're going to need some way to create a form. Now, there's all kinds of form builders in all kinds of email systems, and frankly, most of them suck. So what I decided to do was build a full drag-and-drop form builder. So if you actually go up here to Tools, you can go to Form Builder, and you can see there is a full drag and drop form builder that you can use. So I'll go ahead and edit one of my existing forms here. It's very simple to use. It's widget based. You just drag your widgets in. You can move it around, resize it, edit it. And of course, there are a bunch of templates as well inside of my mailit. So that way you can build beautiful, professional, high quality forms. You can also use these forms as pop ups too if you want. Now, one of the really cool things about my mail it and the fact that I use it in my own business is that I will constantly be updating it. A big problem that people have that buy IM products is they buy something, it's cool, it looks like it works great, and then like a month or two months or six months or even a year later, it suddenly vanishes. The vendor just disappears and the product goes to shit or it completely disappears as well. Now, I use my mail it in my business, so not only is it not going to disappear because I intend to stay in business, but it's also going to constantly improve. As a matter of fact, I want to show you a feature that I recently added, not because one of the testers had asked for it, because I do have about 470 people testing this besides myself, but not because one of the testers added it. I added a new feature because I realized I wanted it, and then when I added it, the testers were really happy to see this new feature because it's handy for everybody. So if I go back over here to the sequences section, I'm going to go ahead and edit one of my sequences, now, when you create a sequence, people sign up, they go on your list, and they're sent this automated sequence. But what happened is, I started thinking, well, what happens when people go through the sequence? What I really want them to do is end up on my review list eventually. I want them to be in this list, go through the, the automated sequence, and then end up on my review list. So what I realized I can do is create what I call the redirect list. So what happens is, when people finish going through this sequence, they will automatically be changed from this list to any other list that I want inside of my system. This way, I don't have to worry about, oh, who went through the sequence, who didn't go through the sequence. I can just let people sign up, let people go through the complete sequence, and then automatically redirect to any other list on my system that I want them to be on. Now, my mail it also comes with a ton of other tools. There are things like list reports, where you can go ahead and see the status for your own list. 
So that way you can get detailed stats on your opens, your clicks, your subscriber growth, and your subscriber loss. There are a bunch of other tools in the system. There's done for you lead pages, there's list checkup, there's the form builder, and as you would expect, it has all the standard features as well. It has things like double opt-in option, so you can have a double opt-in or a single opt-in list. It automatically puts an unsubscribe link on the bottom of your emails. You don't even have to worry about that. It has an automated unsubscribe form as well, where you can put a custom message to try to keep the subscriber if they're going to try to unsubscribe. It has all kinds of features that you would expect in a full service email platform. So far, I've sent out several hundred thousand emails with this system. I've actually sent out a total of 55 broadcast emails and a whole bunch of sequence emails. I've had 159,405 opens and 46,000 clicks from a list of 10,500. If we actually go over to the system stats, you can see there are a total of 470 people currently using this right now. This is myself and the beta testers because in order to release the software, you have to test it with a lot of people to make sure it functions properly. So I have quite a few people testing this, helping me make sure it's fine tuned before I release. Uh, total, we have sent out 613,771 emails. We have 83,201 subscribers, 165,884 total opens. System is working very well, and it's going to continue to improve and get better, not just before the launch, but after the launch ongoing, because as I said, this is a system that I use in my own business. All of my marketing emails are going out with my mailing. I don't even have my marketing list in another system. It's completely by my mail it that I'm running my business. So that's just a quick update on the MyMailit platform. I'm super excited about it. I hope I didn't you know, annoy people or bore people with this update, uh, but it's a platform that I'm really excited. I can't wait to release it. I can't wait for April to get here uh, because this is something I've put a lot of sweat, effort, and hard work in, and I really think people are going to enjoy it. Thank you and enjoy.